There's someone here. Is that a girl? You're awfully noisy. Who are you? I'd like to know the same thing. Who are you? And why are you in such a place? Answering a question with another question? Uh, let me guess. You got swallowed by a Zoogle too? I was invited, actually. Invited, huh? Is that what we're calling getting swallowed? Hmm. This really is a strange place. Hey, don't ignore me! It's a different domain, too. The air is pure and clean, without any trace of malevolence. At the same time, it isn't stable either. This world is suffused with a power that's familiar, yet also completely different from any I know. I'd gotten my hopes up for a moment. Unfortunately, my brother doesn't seem to be here, as far as I can tell. I'm sorry, what were you just saying? Listening in on a young girl's private musings, are we? How very gauche. It was just an honest question. Another question? Ugh, this is why I don't like humans. Humans? Look, my name's Alfin. What would it take to get a straight answer out of you? Hmm. Try saying, pretty please, Miss Edna. Then I might be more inclined to talk. Pretty please, Miss Edna. I'm as in the dark as you are. Is it really okay to fight a little girl? I wouldn't worry about that. Dorling's right. Sometimes appearances can be deceiving. Going in. Demon Fang! This one's... Yeah. 
Are you a monster? No, not a monster. Just Edna. Looks like there's still no way out. Time for you to uphold your end of the deal and answer our question. Although, we already know she's not from the same world as ours. You were saying something about your brother earlier. Is he here too? It's complicated. Answer the question, lady. You don't give up, do you? Tell you what, since you beat me, I'll do you a favor. What's this? It's something I found when I arrived here. You might have a use for it. And what are you going to do? I was just wondering the same thing. I guess I'll have to study this place a bit further. What are you hoping to find? Oh, wait, don't tell me. That's too many questions. I can appreciate a being with basic deductive reasoning skills. Well done. What's this? A Zoogle? Good question. Let's see. Hold on. That Edna girl we ran into in the last world. She was saying something about a brother, right? Wait, you think this- Could this be part of the reason? I guess this won't go like it did with Edna. It doesn't seem like- You're over- Look out! Edna, forgive me! Don't apologize to her! Hmm. Something tells me we should take this seriously.
This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Here, let's Demon go! Peg. Peg. I owe you one! Explosive ring! Demon Peg! Shattering it all! Pieces! Let me touch up! Armor won't save you! Shield and bank! Let the play inside me! Yours can be let free! Demon Peg! So, are you all right? Let me handle this one. So sorry to disappoint you. Inferno crossing! Take this! By the power of No further! Vanish without a trace! Now you see what I can do! Good to know my training is paying off. Who are you people? Oh, it's gotta be him for sure, right? Same hair color. It's a pretty safe bet. Hey! I'm standing right here, you idiots. The brother seems rather uncouth. There's only one person who gets to call me brother, and it isn't you. Now, how do you know Edna? If you mean the girl with the parasol, we ran into her just a while ago. You did, huh? So she's nearby? In that case, it's best I don't stick around. Besides, I've got a ship to hurry up and get back to. Wait, you're avoiding your own sister? Why? So she won't get caught up in the Reaper's curse. Huh? You know, I kind of like you. If I'd known you'd turn out to be this cool, I'd have asked your sister more about you. Did she get that whole, I'll answer one question if you beat me thing from you? Excuse me? Just what did you do to my sister? We fought and defeated her in combat. Wait. So you're saying you hurt her? Better brace yourselves then. Cause nobody lays a hand on my sister. None of you are leaving this place alive. Whoa, settle down. We didn't have much of a say in the matter. There's no reasoning with big brothers. My own used to go off in a fury anytime someone made me cry. You're not helping, Kisara. Just fight the guy. Here he comes.
Edna wouldn't listen to reason either. Must run in the family. The goal never used to let being outnumbered keep him from a challenge. Kisara, please come back. And that's the long and short of it. Oh, I see. So she asked you to fight her. 
I hope that was a suitably satisfactory explanation. Yeah, I get the picture. You guys are pretty good in a fight, too. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But you're still not off the hook for hurting her. You already said that. Still, maybe it was my fault. It could be I was close enough for her to get caught up in the Reaper's curse. Now, I doubt this Reaper's curse you speak of has any meaningful influence here, in this convergence of worlds. After all, this place still technically rests upon our realm's soil. Makes sense. In that case, maybe... Nah. Do you still feel awkward about seeing your sister? <sighs> Here. You guys can have this. I'm gonna do my own thing. <sighs> you know what? I'm starting to miss having no sense of pain. It's freezing. Immunity to pain doesn't equal an immunity to sickness, you know. I get the distinct impression we've met these things before. They look pretty tough. Please be careful, everyone. Not for nothing, but is there any magical way to tell if these things have keys on them or not? Magic isn't a tool for finding lost trinkets. Come on, fighting should help warm me up anyway. They look similar, all right. Where are the colors different? It must be tied to their elements somehow. In that case, I call dibs on the red one. You're just hoping it'll warm you up. Just like that, Get I'm one back time. in it. Start by holding the front line. No sooner said than done. Okay, here I go. You made me angry. Blah, blah, that was a bad idea. I'll stop it, Charles. Thank you, Sire. Is this it? You picked the wrong fight. Right. We've almost got it. Almost isn't quite there yet. I'll get out of this. I'm right with you, Captain. You see what I can do. 
I can feel my power growing! Here comes the big one! Demon Fang! Now you see what I can do! 
you guys again I see you and your brother found each other you could say that technically you couldn't after all it's not like my brother arrived where I was by choice <sighs> in the end we only met because it was a coincidence it leaves me at my wits end really Edna look even if all this did somehow lead to you coming back to me after we return to our world. The brother I know always stands at the helm of his own ship. When it comes to brothers, they can make choices that seem a bit selfish sometimes. What really matters is whether you have faith in them. My brother would hardly be swayed by such extenuating circumstances. So for now, I guess I'll just have to enjoy this time while it lasts. Edna told me all about it, you know. You tried to rush her as a group, didn't you? I don't like where this is going. Technically, I never actually let you guys off the hook. However, I'll hear you out. If you can withstand the power of our bond as siblings. What does their sibling bond have to do with... He's talking about showing us how much they mean to each other. Like me and Magal used to do. If that's something I can give them, then I won't back down. The Kisora? Challenge accepted. This will be a good chance for me to sever my ties with the past. You used to be such a little pipsqueak. You've grown strong. You have no idea how to compliment a lady, do you? Not only that, but you're as precious as ever. That punch crazy idiot said something during the fight. Ma, you're the last person that gets to call someone a punch crazy idiot. Who cares? Just focus!
Don't say I didn't warn you. Shooting star! Here it comes! Hood focus! On your toes, everyone! Her sister's arms had the battlefield torn up with her brother attacking from above. Talk about sibling synergy. Who needs words when you've got that kind of thought? You need to sound happy about it. Armor won't save you! Demon Don't give up! All that running around is catching up with you. No, I, I don't think that's it. Break your spear. Get out of the way! They're not playing for us, infuriating. Get out of the way! Caught in a bind? Armor won't save you! Can't be the world! Do it! Your arms just make the way! Do it, Kisara! Frozen! Hammer! Nicely done! All this is you! You picked the wrong fight. Here we go. Here goes. And Corruption. just like that, we're back in. Start by holding the front line. No sooner said than done. I have no limits. You actually stood up to the both of us together. I'm impressed. I'll accept my loss gracefully and not put on any airs. You're passable. I'll grant you that much. If that's not putting on airs, what is? In truth, it might have been a different outcome entirely if we had fought you in your realm. Our victory is certainly no reason for conceit. Absolutely. You were both worthy opponents. I'd hardly call that resounding praise. Still, thanks for giving us this time together. Edna. Judging from the way you're talking, are you from the same world, but different times? I suppose we are. I'd sooner not bore you with the tedious details, though. I don't know the hows or whys of it, but this is some kind of warped space that connects different worlds and times. Its existence is much to do with a mistake born of our own world. I apologize for dragging you into this mess. Hey, I got to see my sister. 
You know what they say about dark clouds and silver linings. You need this, right? Go on, take it. You could always tag along with us if you wanted. You guys would definitely liven things up. I appreciate the offer. But we've got business of our own to take care of back home. I'm going back eventually. But in the meantime, I've got tons of catching up to do. I'm not sure we'll even get to keep our memories from here after we leave, but... I'm glad I got to see my brother. So am I.